Okay, so as you guys know, I, I made some drawings from My Hero Academia. So I'm gonna do like an actual review of them and tell you guys what the process was in making all these drawings. So currently I have made 13. So let's see. Let's move this more up here. Okay, so um this one um it was my first one and before I before I started drawing this, I didn't think that I would like try and draw the whole class. So the hair was my favorite part um, because it just has a really cool design and I like that split on. You can't really see it. Like that split between his hair. It's okay, I'm sorry. Okay, so the next one that we have is this one. So you're probably wondering, why did I put um, some black in his hair? Well, the picture that I used actually, um, actually has a shadow on his hair. So I had to draw some black on it to make it look like there was, um, a shadow so yeah so next one that we have is this um i okay i messed up because i put an outline and it just looks weird now but if i would not have put that outline it would have looked perfect next we have mina um the pink is super messy and the yellow. I was in a hurry because I needed to go to sleep, so I was a little sloppy. So this next one we have Aoyama. Um, yeah, there's nothing really that special about it. Um, it's just like a picture of a little bit more than half of his face with a purple background. Uh, next one we have is Asui. Um, I didn't have the right the right type of green for her hair, so I just had to use the green that I already had. Now we have Shoji. This is one of my favorites. Um, yes, I purposely put it black and white. Um, yeah, I think it's really cool because it's it's it may just be half of his body, but you know, it looks really cool. Okay, the next one we have is the teacher um Midnight. You might not know her real name. Her real name is Nemuri Kayama or Kayama. I don't know how you say it. Um I didn't uh, get the right color for the hair. It's sort of like purplish, but you know, I did what I could do and and the end it turned out fine. Okay, so next we have Kirishima. Um, <laughs> there's nothing, I don't know what to say. Like. I can't give any more details, like, it's just a drawing. He has a backpack. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Okay, so this has to be my favorite. It's Bakugos. Oh, this is sick. And you're probably wondering, how did I get that shade of hair? Well, basically, um... I have watercolors and I can mix them to make type, types of colors. So I mixed uh, white and yellow and a little bit of black and it gave me this color for his hair. So yeah, 
Next we have Kyoko Jiro. Uh, again, I messed up on the hair. Um, but I didn't have the right colors. So yeah. Um, next we have one of my other favorites. Yaoi Rosu. Um, I like it because the picture is big. Um, I like the hair. I messed up on the hair because I didn't have like gray and I had to paint some gray. So yeah, and it messed up the um I messed up these parts like where I shade where I shaded in with the uh, Sharpie. I messed up those parts so I had to write it with the Sharpie. I mean Sharpie, yeah. To make it look better. Um next we have Tokoyami. Uh, again, not nothing really that special. Um, another drawing, a bird dude, bird man, purple background, looks sick. And the, and the one that I drew just, I mean, the one that I finished just right now is Ida. Um, you're probably wondering, what is that shading right there? Well, basically, in the picture, he had this, like, upside-down upside, upside down triangle type of shadow. So, yeah. Um, it's pretty boring because there's not really that many, like, colors. So, okay, let's give an example of a picture with colors. Like this, you see? Bakugos, he has orange yellow and black and he has blue on his shirt with this type of hair red eyes it's super cool but then i got this nothing really that special um yeah oh that's it um i'm plan i'm i'm go i'm gonna draw um all the all the other seven from class one name and um i might draw like kakashi from naruto next i mean like after i finish the class so yeah um look forward to it and i'll see you in the next video